Ever pondered what time really is? Is it a dimension, a measurement, or just a mind-boggling illusion? These questions have been riddling mind since the dawn of consciousness. Come, let's dive headfirst into an exciting exploration of philosophical and scientific interpretations to crack this enigma. From the earliest thinkers to the contemporary scholars, time has been a subject that has stirred deep reflections and wild speculations. The ancient Greek philosopher Heraclitus saw time as a constantly changing entity, going as far as to say that no man ever steps the same river twice. In stark contrast, his contemporary Parmenides argued, argued that time is a mere illusion and the universe remains unchanging, and now fast forward to the era of Isaac Newton. He put forth concept of time as an absolute entity. Newton viewed time as a relentless force, unfazed by the events of the universe, a linear river flowing unswervingly from past to present to future. But wait, the 20th century genius Albert Einstein had a bone to pick with this standpoint. With, with his groundbreaking theory of relativity of relativity, Einstein argued that time is not constant, but relative, influenced by one's speed and the force of gravity encountered. He painted as a vast, flexible fabric rather than a fixed river. These mind-bending perspectives reflect the roller coaster ride of understanding time throughout history. They paint a picture of time that is tangible yet incredibly abstract, constant yet variable, real yet possibly illusory. As we plunge deeper into our understanding of the cosmos, the true nature of time remains elusive, still one of the great mysteries of existence. Now let's buckle up and warp the annals of history to see how our predecessors interpreted time. Embark with us on a journey to a world where the ticking of clocks didn't exist. Can you imagine such a world? This was the everyday experience of our ancestors until an innovation, an innovation called sundials, came into existence. Sundials, captivating devices that used the sun's trajectory to measure time, represented a significant breakthrough in mankind's quest to keep track of time. Ancient civilizations from the Egyptians to the Greeks crafted these fashionable timekeepers. They would embed a stick, known as a gnomon, a flat surface. As the sun journeyed across the sky, the shadow of the gnomon would shift its position, thus indicating, indicating the time. This elegantly simple and innovative invention impacted everyday life, bringing a sense of order and predictability. Daily tasks could be planned around the time of day. Life to be defined not only by day and night, but by hours that could be counted. The advent of sundials marked the beginning of our timekeeping adventure, a journey that would eventually lead to mind-blowing inventions. Leaving the era of, of sundials behind, let's explore another captivating invention that further transformed our understanding of time. Imagine an hourglass with sand flowing seamlessly through its thin channel, a flawless metaphor for the evanescent nature of time that, that gently glides away from our hold. As the sun rose on the 14th century, this metaphor materialized, the hourglass. This extraordinary contraption, apparently straightforward yet deeply significant, embodied the pinnacle of human inventiveness. Twin glass bulbs, gracefully intertwined by a lean neck carrying the exact quantity of sand that would require one full hour to flow from the peak to the base. This was more than just a practical tool, it was a token, a token that illustrated the ephemeral quality of time and a reminder of our fleeting existence. The hourglass was fused into various aspects of life, from determining the duration of sermons and speeches to assessing the stretch voyages. It served as a stalwart comrade in the quest for accuracy and discipline amidst the of disorder. Though the hourglass marked a significant leap, the marathon of timekeeping did not conclude. As the sands of time persistently streamed, so did our ceaseless endeavor to dominate the force of time. The inception of the mechanical clock introduced more than just a step forward in technology. It ignited a revolution revolution in the way we interact with time. Before its creation, time was dictated by nature's rhythm, the rise and fall of the sun, the cyclic turn of the seasons. However, in an era before the rhythmic ticking of clocks, time was an elusive concept rather than a quantifiable reality. 
The mechanical clock, with its complex matrix of wheels and gears, altered this entirely. Originating in the 14th century, these devices seamlessly integrated into the society's fabric, serving as precise measuring tools for the passage of time, projecting and wealth, their echoing chimes aligning societies to a communal beat. The mechanical clock not only transformed our tracking of time, but reshaped our existence, our work ethics, and our perception of time. Its ticking turned into a metronome for progress, driving the expansion of trade, navigation and science. Due to the mechanical clock, time metamorphosed from a flexible subjective concept into a tangible measurable fact. Hours, minutes and seconds turned into life's new currency. The saying time is money was born from this transformation. Time was no longer just fleeting, it could now be controlled and even commercialized. The ticking of the clock served as a constant reminder of time's fleeting nature and the significance of making every moment matter. However, the mechanical clock marked just the start of our continuous evolution with time. As we'll delve into in the following sections, the path from towering clocks to wristwatches and beyond demonstrates how time, once a natural phenomenon, became a tradable commodity, all thanks to the invention of the mechanical clock. Today, we find ourselves immersed in the era of time. It is embedded in our smartphones, displayed on our computer and worn around our wrists. But how did we reach this point? Scrutinizing the complex history of timekeeping, the transition from mechanical to digital clocks was a significant milestone. This evolution was not merely a technological progression, but it reshaped our engagement with time at a fundamental level. The rhythmic ticking of the mechanical clock, an engineering marvel, symbolized humankind's triumph over time, a strategy to tame the ceaseless flow of seconds and minutes into a structured, manageable rhythm. However, as the 20th century unraveled, the comforting rhythm of the mechanical clock was replaced by the relentless, silent pace of the digital clock. In this new phase of digital timekeeping, the physical movement of gears and hands gave way to the invisible vibration of electric currents. Time morphed into a sequence of radiating on screens in fluorescent green or icy blue hues. This transformation in timekeeping technology didn't merely change how we monitored time. It revolutionized our comprehension and experience of time. With the introduction of digital clocks, time became more exact, more immediate. We could measure seconds and milliseconds with an accuracy that was inconceivable with mechanical clocks. But this accuracy came at a cost. With digital clocks, time became omnipresent. It was no longer a remote ticking sound, a rhythm subtly echoing in the backdrop of our lives. It was right there in our pockets, on our screens, relentlessly nudging us of the unceasing progression of seconds, minutes and hours. However, this prevalence of time has also enhanced our ability to manage our lives, to align our activities across different time zones, to quantify the fleeting moments that make up our days. A time, once a mystery and a wonder, has evolved into a tool, a resource we utilize and adjust to suit our needs. And thus, thus, we've journeyed from sundials to smartwatches, from an era when time was a mystery to an era where it is readily accessible at our fingertips. So what is time, really? This mystery has perplexed us humans for centuries. Tracing back to archaic sundials etched in stone, to the grandeur of towering clocks, our ancestors have always strived to capture time, to bring rhythm to their existence and structure to their communities. Time, initially measured by the moving shadows cast by the sun, morphed into a series of mechanical ticks and tocks with the commencement of clockmaking, and then came an era where time found a comfortable abode in our hands, transitioning smoothly from pocket clocks to wristwatches, and now to smartwatches. Time, once a collective entity, has now become a personal one, tailored to our unique lives, our routines, our daily patterns. From the sun to silicon, our understanding, our understanding and use of time has been an incredible journey of creativity, evolution and human curiosity. As we have observed, time isn't just a measure. It's a narrative, a narrative of innovation, growth and human exploration. As time unfailingly moves forward, we can only speculate about the next chapter this narrative will reveal in the future.